GCSE teachers. In this short video, I want to show you a couple of fun and hopefully useful items that may help you organize your Canvas dashboard. Obviously, when you have your courses for the semester, the course is assigned a color and a name. Those are very easy to change. If you click on the square with a pencil, the menu will come up. You will have the option to give your course a new nickname. So if I want to get rid of demo for my demo course, I can just if I want to type new nickname, I could do that right here. And then I could choose one of the colors and I hit apply. And my course tile will take the attributes of what I just selected. However, you, you may have noticed that the number of colors here is very limited. What I can do if I want to choose a color that is not listed here, I can simply open a new tab on my browser. I can Google the phrase color picker and Google will show me what is a color picker and I can slide along and I can choose any color that I want in this range. Let's say I want a very bright green. I just click over here, find the one that I want, and then I'm going to highlight this number. I'm going to copy that, highlight, right click, copy. I'm going to go back over to the user dashboard over here. I am going to then uh, paste that and I'm going to hit apply and it will take the attribute of the new color that I just chose. So you have essentially thousands of colors that you can choose from. You are not limited by the 10 or 12 or 15 colors that it has there for your course. So that's an easy way to change the course nickname and also the course color. That's, this helps especially if you have multiple courses with the same title. If I want to add a picture, this is a common question that I get, and in fact Canvas just added this option a couple of months ago. If I open my course, which again in this case is my demo course, or I gave it a new nickname. Um, I have multiple options here on the left, of course, and if I go to settings, I will have the option to choose an image. And when I go there, I have two options. I can drag and drop here. Actually, I have three, I have, sorry, I have three options. I can drag or drop here. I can browse my computer for a file, or I can search on Flickr. So let's just say this is a uh, class and I want to use the computer. If I Google computer, it shows me pictures that are free and in the public domain that are allowed to be used. So I'm just going to grab this picture right here. And then I am going to update course details. I am going to go back to my dashboard. And there is my course. It has the, it is still a demo course. I gave it a new nickname. By typing new nickname, I have the picture, um, which is framed in the lime green. If I don't like the way the lime green frames that, of course, I could go back to the pencil, go back to color picker, choose a new color that would be a little bit more transparent. But those are hopefully some simple and fun tools that will help you organize your Canvas course as you get rolling in a new semester. If you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, best of luck. Mm -hmm.